have some fun, <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. So let's take a look at some of the good times. Diana looked amazing on the horse. I did felt a little awkward. I did felt. <laughs> I did. The relationship that Jeremy and I have has continuously grown into some grown grown has continuously grew into something. Grown. Grown. Whatever. Whatever. I'm gonna put a piece of wheat in your mouth. Keep talking. I'm listening. Oh, they're gonna I think they're good. gonna play ball. Oh. <laughs> Tell me what's endearing about Sean. The mullet, obviously, that goes without saying. Business in the front, party in the back. Are you starting to think a little bit about the old uh, chaparral? Is he a haircut away from winning your heart? I hope she likes it, I do. No. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> do you think he fought in the Cobra Kai dojo in Karate Kid? Iron sharpens iron. Ron is Socrates, that's what I call him. Steel can't be sharpened. Um, <laughs> with 10. You can't force a flower to open. You can't say, open flower, because I'm asking you now. Sometimes the tree gets knocked down before it ever gets to bear its fruit. Tribal yell, baby. Oh! <laughs> Definitely uh, wasn't all tears. We had some good times, uh, a lot of good times, in fact. And uh, I know we are all dying to find out who you will choose. Obviously, you can't tell us the ending, but are you happy? Are you in love? I am very happy. I am in love, and I am engaged. Really? <laughs> Congratulations, because that is breaking news. We have not said that yet, so you are engaged and to whom we will find out very shortly. Coming up next, we will take a much closer look at Jason and Jesse, the two final men left in Deanna's life. Now, the best exit in Bachelorette history would have to go to Greg. Greg, <laughs> why don't you take us to break, my friend? Go ahead. Can we get a little howl going on? 